Hi, I'm Andrew Williams, Product Manager at Vantage England and Wales, formerly AS Communications. Today, we're going to be looking at the Precision IQ system and how to check if it's capable of receiving the upgraded RTX frequency. The first thing we need to check is the firmware version. To do this, the easiest way is to slide from the top left hand corner of the screen down and tap on the status item. This will bring up a diagnostics menu. From here, we can check the firmware of the TMX display. The minimum firmware version for a TMX 2050 display is 4.2.1. My display is on 4.6, so this is more than capable of receiving the RTX frequency. If your home screen does not look like this and is the newer type tile design, then it means your display is already up to date and will not need a firmware upgrade. You will, however, need to check the frequency, which we'll look at later in this video. Once we've checked the firmware version, we can now check the frequency and, if necessary, update it. To do this, we need to tap on the satellite icon in the top right-hand corner, then GNSS Setup. From here, we can choose our correction source. This should be one of the RTX solutions. If we then click on Setup, we can see which frequency the display is running. In my case, I'm running the older 1539.8125 frequency. This will need upgrading. To do this, tap on the frequency button. The new frequency we need to input is 1545.8. 4900 megahertz. Once we've entered it in, press the tick. We also need to check the board rate, and this should be at 2400. Once we've done this, we need to press next, next again, and be sure to save the settings by pressing the save button. This means my frequency has now been updated. If your Precision IQ display is of a newer type tile design, like this one, then the firmware is up to date. You will, however, need to check the frequency. To do this, click on the GNSS tile, press Edit, check that you are using one of the RTX sources, click on the Setup tab, and then click on Frequency. You will need to update to the newest frequency, which is 1545.4900, then press tick. It's also worth to check that the board rate is at 2400. Once satisfied, press the save button and the settings are complete. If you need any help with this, please don't hesitate to call our support line on 01480 860 110. Thanks for watching.